What is up guys? Today we're back with another vlog and today we're gonna be installing a mod I've been wanting to do for quite a while on this uh, this year Focus. And uh, finally got the SVT wheels that I've been wanting. So they're the 15 spoke black ones. Um, yeah, so let's go check them out. I'll show you right now. So here they are, got all four, just got some new tires on them. Ish, they're used, but you gotta go with what's cheaper sometimes. But yeah, just got some 21550 R17s on these things, and um, yeah, we're gonna put them on that thing soon. So yeah. So it got too dark for me to film anything with me putting the wheels on, but here they are right now. Pretty sick. I think they're, oh crap, I almost fell over a speaker. Anyway, um, yeah, I love them. I think they're great. I got the tires and wheels to rally spec. So they're the same size and all that as the ones in WRC and all that. So, but right now what I'm doing if you're uh, not familiar with the 05 intake system, it's a, it's a bunch of crap. And um, yeah, I'm just trying to fix that. I ordered some of these intake materials to kind of make my own because I'm kind of on a budget right now. And um, yeah, normally it would come out of here, go straight down to there. What we're trying to do is modulate this right here, just to make it go from here to here, cut this off and put a filter right here so the filter's just right here and it doesn't have any of this weird stuff because it's just a hassle and it's not getting enough air to the engine that i like so anyway that's what we're doing right now and uh yeah i'll update you guys when we uh get this modded up to what we need because we need to we need to cut this off right here this can fit onto that anyway so we're gonna do a freaking time lapse or something. I don't know, bud. Just uh, try and get her done. And yeah, I don't, I'm I'm really running out of content ideas. There's already a video that's decent for this. The main reason I'm doing all this is because the ECU has been throwing some codes saying that I'm running too lean. I'm guessing it's the back pressure from me cutting the exhaust off. So, and it's not getting enough air to it. So that's why we're doing this. But yeah, so that's why we're doing it. And we're gonna do it because we got to do it because I finally cut this thing off. So, um, this was right here attached to that. So I cut that off to make room for the filter to fit inside there when we put it in there. So all we got to do is tighten that, tighten this on there and yeah, connect that math air airflow sensor to it and see if it works. So I finally got it done. Um, this is it. So I got the MAF airflow sensor in there, all set up. Got this all clamped up and it's just gonna sit in there all nice and clean, but I'll have to probably maneuver it in there a little bit, but it should sit kind of like that. Kind of looks trashy cause the engine bay is kind of dusty, but hey, it's gonna be a lot better than what I had before, because that, that just, it wasn't doing it. Is the flash not on? Cool. Okay, so got it done. It's in. It's looking pretty sick. Um, I'm gonna start it up and see it sounds any different it probably will just a little bit but probably not too drastically but um but it's definitely gonna pull a whole bunch more air and i'm just excited for it to perform better
know, so you can obviously tell that sounds a lot better. I'm pretty happy with it. Um, right now, I'm going to head over to Jordan's, and we're going to work on his Ranger. I don't know what's happening with that. Last time I heard, I think his uh, catalytic converters were clogged or something like that. So we're going to probably head over there and uh, see what we can do to fix that. So long story short, um, we're going to have to poke him out to get it running good again. And um, I really didn't film much because we didn't even fix anything. So that's a, that's a project for the future. But what we are today, doing today, also exhaust related, is that we're going to be uh, taking one of the other resonators out of my car to make it a little bit louder. Because I already did the muffler delete, but it's not as loud as I wanted it to be. So we're going to take off another resonator and yeah, so that's pretty much what we're doing today. I think we may also have to replace my wheel bearings, which I've been meaning to do for a while. But yeah, that's kind of the plan for today. I'll show you guys what this thing sounds like right now. back from the exhaust shop are you gonna zoom in all this <laughs> <laughs> anyway we just got back from the exhaust shop and uh it sounds amazing it even feels faster but um we got the resonator deleted it's all it's right over there just chilling yeah i'll just start it up and i'll show you all what it sounds like This thing is just so much better. Actually sounds like a rally car instead of the suppressed, you know, economy car that it was, but yep. Also something that I forgot to note when um, I did the intake, I uh, accidentally did it backwards to where in the O2 sensor. Math. Math airflow sensor. Thank you. Was like over here, and like this whole thing had to be flipped around because the map airflow sensor was facing the wrong way. So it was like cutting out when I was driving over here. But we just flipped the pipe around, to make it facing the right way, and I didn't have a problem after that. It's all good. But yeah, that's a uh, that's what's been going on with this thing, and it's just a lot better now. So. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness. Let's even get her to slide into the. <laughs> As you see, the focus is coming together. The thing just. It just breathes so much better with the new intake, new exhaust. And uh, we're not even done with the exhaust. We still got, you know, the flame kit coming up. We got a new wing we got to put on. We got to replace the wheel bearing so it's going to drive a lot better. But it's just, we have so many things planned for this thing. It's just so hype. But um, that's going to be it for today's video. And until um, then, I'll see you guys in the next one. I'm going to have a bad